We really have partnered with the Huntsville Public Library to provide programs to young people in Huntsville. It's an area that is a little tougher for us to reach, so that was kind of the initial ask of um, our partnership, which has been great and extremely beneficial. Um, and then, you know, we had the idea for a yard sale at Big Brothers Big Sisters of Muskoka, and I thought, what better way to utilize a great organization in this space that they have, but to see if they want to partner in, in a fundraiser, which we haven't really done in the past. So it was just a new opportunity, really. So I think that this, or the hope for this is to uh, foster something that we can work towards together to build and see where it goes from. Uh, we both have uh, very similar goals and outlooks for the community. Um, and so, and then the long story short of, the, of this uh, first sort of big step, uh, the yard sales to hope to raise, raise funds for both organizations and help the community. Big Brothers Big Sisters will be using funds to help support our programming, help uh, get our number of matches back up. It does cost us around $1,500 per year to fund a match and um, we have quite a few littles waiting and especially quite a few in Huntsville so we'll be looking forward to raising funds in order to get them off our wait list. Since the pandemic our, our rental revenues have not been where they are so it will be going towards uh, bolstering our operating revenues uh, that we usually are expected to see. We are seeing of course more bookings for our spaces coming in but just not where they were pre-pandemic and so that's what we'll be using the funds for is just the, the operating expenses of the library. So uh, people can donate items, unused, uh, or sorry, unwanted, gently used items to this uh, to this fundraiser. They can start dropping off items September 1st. The main drop-off location is the Huntsville Public Library. But if you're unsure about items, uh, you can always give us a call, either organization, um, and we can help you figure out what might be a good fit and what might not be a good fit. We can also arrange times for larger items, um, but know that we aren't accepting items that are made of cloth uh, for various reasons, but you know, decor, gardening tools, um, camping equipment, all of that stuff is very welcome.